guys welcome back i wanted to do a quick i guess little review or just giving my two cents on this um drugstore foundation and concealer um i was actually surprised that this worked so well for me it's the covergirl ready set gorgeous um fresh complexion oil free foundation number 315 now I believe they do have deeper toned foundations um, but I actually couldn't find mine and like this one I had to go outside my neighborhood to find this and I live in a West Indian predominantly West Indian African American neighborhood and this was the lightest concealer that I could find I'm sorry this was the deepest concealer that I could find and this is number 4070 and again this is number 315 um, the coverage is really really nice I'm actually using it now it's a medium I want to say it's a medium to full coverage um, you really don't need unless you really really need you really don't need foundation um, so tongue-tied right now foundation um medium to full coverage you really don't need concealer unless you just really really need it um but with this i don't have to like if i'm just gonna wear this to go i don't have to wear concealer with this because it actually gives really good coverage without looking so thick without looking cakey like i can still see my freckles peek through but it's enough coverage that what minimum darkness i may have is covered even coverage going around so it's a good it's a good foundation for get up and go you just want a fresh face this is it this is really good especially for a drugstore i don't have that many drugstore foundations um the only other one that i really liked was the maybelline fit me i loved that one I love that one so I thought I would try this and I've had it if I want to say over a month and I would use it every now and then but this month I decided that I would really really use this and I've been using this a lot so a lot of my previous videos that you've seen a lot of the collabs I'm using this or my Dior BB cream but I'm using this I mean great color matching once you find your color um, now the concealer <laughs> You see how light this sucker is? And believe it or not, this is the darkest one that I could find anywhere near my neighborhood. So that's obviously, that would be used as a highlighter. But even with it so, this is, this however is a little thinner in consistency. Um, but you could obviously use this to highlight areas of your face. I've used it maybe twice maybe and don't quote me on that could have just been once but I, I do remember using it and just ended up going over it with another concealer um, just because I wanted a little more coverage so if you're looking for uh, like a heavy cover heavy, heavy, heavy coverage concealer I, I wouldn't recommend this one if you're looking just for a light to highlight you know then okay go ahead and get this one I don't know what other shades they are. This is the, the darkest one I could find of all the Rite Aids that I went to. I was even actually surprised that I found that foundation. It was the only one on the display. And she just put the display out. It was the only one they had and everything else was this color. So I just wish there was more of a color range. And if there is, it needs to be all over the place. I'm, I'm sorry, but sending a display to a predominantly black neighborhood and this is what we have to choose from that that don't work I mean I know it doesn't work and I y'all know I like to how like y'all know I like to glow but that's just a little too much for me but the foundation I think is actually really really good um it's inexpensive it was maybe like seven bucks seven ninety nine but if you have Rite Aid and you know you got their points in the system or whatever it's twenty percent off of this so and I got it when it was on sale so yeah that's it that's my two cents i give it a i guess i can give it a two thumbs up concealer i i can't even give it a one thumbs up maybe a, a nub maybe a nub that's that's about it that's all it's gonna get but yeah oh it has a name that is <laughs> it's number 315 but it's called 20 20 i'm 20 guys i'm 20 
Anywho, love y'all. And I know someone's going to ask. Go on my lips. I have Inglot's lip paint in number 69. Uh, I want to hit you with a 69. Uh, that's probably inappropriate to sing, right?